Hi friends, today we are discussing the a basic concept of the uh, dependent parameters. What are the dependent parameters is there in this network? Resistor, inductor, capacitor. We are discussing one by one. These are the dependent parameters. Dependent parameters. Resistor, inductor, capacitor. These three basic information I will give. First, if you go for the resistor, if you go for the resistance, the resistance exactly what is doing? The resistor is dissipation of the power, means it will eat the power, it will give the corresponding output. If it is a light, give the illumination, if it is the heater. Output it will give the heating elements means take the power and give the output dissipation of the energy. The units of resistance is called ohms. V is equal to IR. Resistor R is equal to V by I. This is the formula for DC circuit. If you go for the AC power, the resistance is equal to rho L by A. This is the formula for the AC. This is the formula for the DC. If it is a DC power, we can calculate this. We are using with the help of this formula, we can calculate. If it is AC power, with the help of this formula, we can calculate. Anyone is given, remaining, you can calculate. This is the resistance. In this resistance, this, uh, this is the ohms. Uh, this is the voltage, this is the amps, current in amps. If you calculate the power, power P is equal to V I. V I is equal to V by R. V square by R. R I square R. These are the, the power units is what? This is the power formula. After that, you will get the energy. Energy is equal to power into time. You will get the energy. The energy units is joule per second or whatever or AWH or MWH. These are the units for the energy. This is the units for the power. This is the units for the amps. This is the units for voltage. This is the units for ohms resistance. This is the basic details of the resistance after that if you go for the resist uh, inductance symbol for this this is the resistor thus this is the resistor symbol this is the inductance symbol if you go for the inductance if you go for the inductance the inductance store the dynamic energy the inductance working function to store the dynamic energy that purpose you are using this inductance the inductance unit is called henry the inductance unit is called henry basically this is the one coil you are given a voltage current is flowing that's producing these are the number of terms Flux linkage is equal to number of terms into flux. Both differentiating with respect to D phi by dt is equal to n into D phi by dt. You will get B. After that, flux linkage is directly proportional to current. So, flux is equal to L into I. Flux linkage is equal to L into I. Both differentiating D phi by dt is equal to L into Di by dt is equal to B. You can compare this and this. N D by by dt is equal to L B I by dt. L is equal to N into D by by di. D by by di. L is equal to N into pi by n. This is the formula for the inductance. This is the formula for the inductance. How to calculate the power in inductance? 
how to calculate the power in inductance v of t into i of t energy is equal to the energy how to calculate in inductance 1 by 2 l i square of t 1, uh, 1 by 2 l i square of t this is the energy formula you can calculate inductive step capacitor is the t capacitor is the units is the farads this is the capacitor this is the capacitor the use of capacitor this is also store the energy in static energy is storing that purpose we are using this capacitors how to calculate this formulas one by one we will see basically the capacitance c is equal to lambda a by d if v is equal to charge by capacitance charge is nothing but current into t by c by capacitance with integration of this you will get integration of this 1 by c integration of i of t dt integration of this you will get after that i of t is equal to c into dv by dt you will get dv by c into dv by dt you will get i of t how to calculate the power v of t is equal to v of t i of t you can calculate power you can calculate capacitor energy 1 by 2 how to calculate 1 by 2 capacitance 1 by 2 c into v square of t with the help of this formula we can calculate energy in capacitors 1 by 2 c v square of t with the help of we can calculate this energy these are the basic details of the resistor inductor and capacitor before go to this uh, current division rule uh, voltage division rule these are the basic if it is the ac supply if it is the, if it is the dc supply if it is in the, if it is the resistance if it is inductance if it is capacitors what is happening resistor ac or dc no change if it is resistor if you go for if you go for inductance in dc ka short circuited in ac ka open circuited if it is the capacitor in dc open circuited in ac capacitor in short circuited this is the very very important uh, circuits solvation purpose how uh, uh, which places which supply you are applying uh, what what's what's what doing in the inductor what is what doing in the capacitor it is very